hello guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome to another video in case you're new here hi my name is Masakare, and to all my returning subscribers welcome back i want to do a thrift haul i want to show you guys some of the things that i have bought not like recently i started buying actually i had planned to do this video earlier but because things happen adulting time and everything so i'm going to compile everything that i bought since you know how since february there yeah up to now <music> telling you guys the price the places where i bought the the clothes yep and what the reason as to why i bought them so i hope you'll enjoy the video and if you haven't subscribed please consider subscribing and join this beautiful family so for the first thing is this dress i'm going to insert a video over here of when when i tried them out so you're going to see a video over here of how the full set looks on me and kindly don't mind the socks i know the socks some of the parts you can see the socks i was at home so this is the dress this is how it actually looks it's a uh, black and white it's a polka dot by the way and the thing that i really loved about this dress is because of the material i really prefer chiffon dress when it comes to dresses i don't know why for some reasons they look classy that is the reason as to why i prefer chiffon dresses mostly and it has a like the hand it also has some pockets and it's a wrap dress it's a wrap dress i know you guys understand when i say it's a wrap dress it's a wrap dress and it also has a pocket can easily be worn by sneakers or a pair of heels yep so that is why i went for it actually let me admit the reason as to why i bought this dress is because it's black and white there's something about me with black and white that i cannot resist it's just in me yeah so that was the first thing that really attracted me to this dress i bought it at was it a thousand bob on an online shop on instagram i'm going to insert uh, the page the page name the clothing the same thing that i got from the same shop but these were on sale actually these cuts Ooh, focus this cut it's um ruffles cut and i also bought it at the same time with this dress but from the same shop the two are going for a thousand bob total the skirt was for 450 if i'm not wrong because they were on sale so i decided to buy them and the reason as to why i wanted this skirt is because of the material can you see the ruffle it has also some like pleat likes on on the ruffles it's so unique um, right you can also style it with sneakers a pair of heels it depends with you with a tight top on top yep so the next thing which i also bought on the same store did, did i say the price I, that one is for 450 the other one was a thousand bob this was for 550 the dress also the dress i've been eyeing this dress for a while now like i first saw them on thrift stores and i said i was broke i didn't have money i wasn't working so i was just like one day i'm going to buy it and then guess what when i was talking through instagram was i was while i was on instagram i saw the the same page head sale so and this dress was on sale and actually it was my size size 12 because by then i was a size 12 right now I've gone down a little bit yep the next thing is this jumpsuit a white jumpsuit it is wide leg this is the first thing that actually attracted me to this it's because it's white leg plus i've also been i've also been looking for a palazzo like white leg jumpsuit if you understand what i mean and so i saw this i was actually going to look for a top and then you know the way somebody chagwa chagwa mtush and then i found this it was for only 300 shillings i bought it at there's a, a kichoro choro there immediately after best lady there's a certain woman who has opened a thrift store there she has dope stuff by the way i bought there several tops and i actually bought this at 300 and 300 kenya shillings only and as you can see it's white it's a little bit bigger on the waist but i'll just get my fundi to do the job or i'll belt it up by the way 
I have a, a certain belt that I'm going to show you in a few. I bought at, I twisted at, what is the name of this shop? Think twice, think twice. Yeah. So for the next thing, let me, let me share the <laughs> I won't believe this, guys. The next thing is this leather jacket. And it's new, like, guys. Can you guess how much I bought this leather jacket? You see, even it's not at a Jararuka anyway, it's still new. It doesn't have any part that is tattered or anything. It's still new. Even the collar, let me show you. It's still new, like new. And also the lining. Can you see that? Squish. You know these these designs in the in, in, in on Instagram or in shops, it's around 2500 and i got this at 400 kenyan shillings only you see where mavazi mavazi is where the task is magic was if you are in akuru that is i'm addressing akuru people hello so if where mavazi is currently that is where i got this actually they were just there and i had i was from work and then i had oh leather jacket 400 shillings i was like hmm? 400 shillings and then i Luckily, I found myself this one, and it fits so perfectly, and it's new. Like, I was like, hey, this one, I can't leave. Even if I'm broke, I'm going to take it. So the, other, the other one is also a leather jacket, but this one, I got it quite expensive. I bought this one before I bought the other one. This one was going for a thousand bob. A thousand or twelve hundred. Somewhere. I can't remember it very well. It's also a black leather jacket. I bought this one at... A place near actually you see how can I explain this? Nakuru neighbors, 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 midtown. They are the, the neighbors in town when that's where Tusky was before, opposite Java. Yeah, the former Java, yeah, there. At the back there is a thrift store over there. They usually have nice clothing over there. So I was directed by a friend actually, and I got this at twelve hundred and I have never worn them these two tops. Bought them at the same place, uh, opposite Otugi. There is a um, shop there, three store there, and they were 50 bob each. I'm going to explain the reason as to why I bought them. First thing first, I didn't have a black chiffon top, so when I got this, I said, No, I'm not going to leave it. Plus, I also loved the details, you know, for the busted woman, women like us, I prefer uh, a button top that has this thing over here because sometimes you can't be walking on the button or just a button and you don't know and it's so embarrassing. So every time I go to buy mostly the top that has button, I usually prefer the one that the buttons are laid over. I don't know if you guys understand what I mean. Like you can't see the button at all, but it's underneath. So I bought this. It's chiffon and also the hands are so beautiful. What the name of that? The bubble, bubble top. I don't know, I can't remember, let me not lie. Yeah, that is the reason I asked why I got this top. And the other one is because of the details. It has so much detail. But the problem with this top is it's so it's a see-through. I have to find like something to wear underneath of which I don't like. So I don't know how I'm going to deal with it, but I'll find a solution to it. Also, the hands, as you can see, the hands are panel top. It's a panel top plus it's black and white. Ooh. Huh? it's black and white and extra details on the neck the neck area it's also buttoned and it has like some ruffle thing over here on the both on the shoulders and on the on the neck so for the next thing guys it's blazers these are long the first one is this green one and as you can see it's still new it also has a lining on the inside it's color blocking that is one thing that made me really love this blazer it's apart from it being long the color blocking of the lining and the material itself plus also the material is so good like and the color can you see this green like the color is so dope ah uh, it's i can't explain anyway but the color is so long and the material is so good i bought this at glanis there are so many stores there glanis street i bought it at one of the store it was going for 500 actually they they were selling me at 650 i bargained it to 500 kenyan shillings yeah so this is the first blazer the second blazer is this one okay black and white huh you just have to bear, bear with me but i actually saw this 
on one of the influencers page i can't remember and the same like almost the same pattern and the design of the blazer because even the other one is a double breast this too is a double breast blazer this one was going for three thousand ten shillings and the moment i got it from a thrift store near nakuru nakuru cosmet east african cosmetic there next day is a thrift over there i got this at they were selling it at 800 i bargained it to 650 and i was like no i'm go i'm not going to leave this one and it's still new you can also see that it has a lining and for my last blazer is the red one this red blazer over here i got this at what is the name of this place they call it nasha nasha market there are so many people who sell clothes there i can't remember the specific store but this one was going for 550 if i can recall well 500 or 550 but i didn't realize that it had a problem with the button but that's okay i'm going to get it fixed i actually worn it last sunday and i noticed when it was too late but i had no option so i'm going to take it to the tailor and get it made and it also has a lining so it's still good so it's worth it so for the next thing is um mommy shorts this one i bought these shorts at i think twice think twice they were on offer the last days it was going for 50 shillings so i was lucky to get it at that price and i also loved the color plus i've also been looking for mommy shorts and they're very expensive and for this belt that i was talking about of designing or styling the the white palazzo the white jacket palazzo i also got this at think twice for 50 shillings it was on a sunday I can't even forget that and i was lucky because there's this there's a certain belt that belt that is trending on this on the internet that goes for 1500 and yeah that money is a lot it's a lot of money y'all so when the moment i saw this i was like you know what i'm going to get it there and for the last thing that really pained me is this dress guys you know the way the reason as to why i bought this dress it was snatching everything that is supposed to be snatched and then i lost weight for my size 12 14 i guess right right now i'm size 10 9 there so it's big but my fundi will have to do something with it i loved it because of the button you see the button forgive me i have a dog that's why you see the fur everywhere my clothes um i loved it because of this detail of the buttons over here plus the material it's so unique like i've never seen a such a material and then you can see the inside the way the inside looks like plus the this is the material the material is so good in a curve is zuri it's looking classy that is the material so i'm just going to take it to my fundi and get it fixed so that it can fit me perfectly and before i forget i have um two pairs of shoes that i want to show you guys and then we call this a video the first one is this old school got it near gilani's from 650 i bargained to 500 kenyan shillings I have a similar pair but it's the different the other one is laced this one is not laced it's like this so i bought a different design which i love and for my current or my latest my latest purchase are these thigh boots like look at that they are thigh boots and they are fitting so perfectly i got this Kuko chini baggage there's a certain man who sells boots over there he mostly sell them to university students and instead of because he was selling them at 2500 he dropped the price up to 1300 kenya shillings that's how good i am at beginning so the next time you go to the thrift store call me call me so i got this at 1300 kenya shillings so make sure to subscribe to this channel if you haven't subscribed liked comment and share and follow me on all my social media platforms at Mata Paris. So until next time, peace. Bye.